Beavis and Butthead are not role models. They're not even human. They're cartoons. Some of these things they do would cause a real person to get hurt, expelled, arrested, possibly deported, to put it another way. Don't try this at home. This is gonna be cool. <laughs> 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 Anyways, using the D-pad and the buttons, you can control their stupid laughter. Go to options real quick. Music on. Actually, I want that shit off. No one wants to hear that stupid thing. No, I'm kidding. Let me turn that back on. Start, wimp, cool, dude, wimp, cool, dude. These are the difficulties, so wimp, cool, dude. Let's go to cool. I haven't played this game in since fucking... Shit, like I was six? Maybe eight? No two players? Let's see what the story's about. I'm not scrolling the text, it's this fast. So, another reason why I learned how to read so fast is because games like these, you know, fucking fast. Yeah, yeah. I like how the TV is just straight up yellow text and says, yeah, this fucking happened. Of course, Gore is pretty badass. In fact, this is the reason... These guys are the reason why I listen to most heavy metal rock metal bands. Rock metal. Hard rock bands. I mean, I still watch these guys. Also, you know, King of the Hill, Daria, all that fun shit. MTV, man. Highland High School. Street to Highland. Highland Hospital. Turbo Mall 2000? Motherfucker, we're going to hide out of high school. We're there, dude. Changing the channel all the damn time. Get ready, dude. <laughs> damn, I've been playing this game forever, but I do remember. I'm not sure if I beat it, but I do remember getting to the second to last level, which is Highland Mall. So let's see if I can actually do this. I mean, I haven't played this in fucking forever. Anyways, uh, Orange Shirt Kids, they're gonna be like, I'm just gonna not yeah. gonna jump. I forgot this fucking character's name too. And they're getting my ass handed to me. Apparently, this game is really hard. It's mostly a memory game. Hopefully, I remember a lot of stuff. You can actually hit this dude right here. I haven't watched this cartoon fucking forever either. Not too much, I'm trying to get used to um, my new controller. I'm well, not really new, I just modified it a little bit. Basically, I want to see if the buttons are still working. Uh. Why don't you tell me? There is someone behind me, you fuck! Alright, hopefully I'll be doing better, cuz. Ah I don't remember, Wells! Damn, I'm doing horrible. This really is a game about memory. I mean, if you play this for the first time yourself. Give me a challenge. Stop. Stop watching this? And try playing it yourself. Download it if you have to. I mean, it is kinda tough, cuz you don't know what the fuck's gonna happen. Like I said, this is a straight up memory game. Anyways, quarters are your currency. You can use them for health or... There we go. You can use it for health. Hurting him does nothing, by the way. You can use it for health or use it for lives or power-ups. I forgot exactly. Remember, I had to stock up on it, especially for the mall. It's supposed to give me food. Sometimes I get food, sometimes you get pizza. Oh yeah, just jump over this dude. He'll attack you. Everyone hates Beavis and Butthead. They all want to kill you. Um, shit. You can switch to Beavis by pressing select, I believe? Yeah. Um, the reason you would have to do that is because there is, um... Be Butthead always launches Beavis. And I can't show you here because it's not safe. Well, Be- Oh uh, yeah, Butthead always launches Beavis. Um, so, because you're gonna need to do that for like uh, certain areas, where you need to dodge or platform around something. Because, as you saw, the jump's not too high. Ah, uh, I was so close to three. I usually get three on that. Anyways, there's no point of hitting him or wasting your ammo or multiple multiplying the hit. But, like he was coming right after me, I had to hit him so he can run away. Alright, luckily I remember there's a, a hidden life here. Ah! I just love doing that. You don't have to worry about ammo conser conservation. But yeah, most people don't know you have to duck to pick those up. They're like, how do I get that shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So, five lives. Um, and I forgot to show off that thing, the launch. Let me see when I get to the stupid gym. But for the most part, lives are important in this game. So it's staying alive. Another reason why being healthy is important. All right. So I can't go anymore, anywhere else anymore. So as far as as far as I remember, these are consider these stages as worlds, and each world has sub levels in them. That's what the passwords are for. But yeah, and anyway, with such a beavis, I just love doing this, especially on two players. It's just fun to do once in a while. But you gotta do, you gotta have some teamwork. Hopefully, I can finish this whole world. Ah, damn it. Yeah. Um, if you... If you... F <laughs> if you whack that fat tub of lard, you know if he'll explode. And he'll drop pizza. <laughs> Anyways, Beavis sucks on the wall! Be careful right here. Actually, I should be getting this dude. Actually, no, I should go to Beavis. I fucked up, I had no choice. Got him. Explode and give me pizza! Ooh, an ice cream. Dario, what's up? Give me pizza. I don't know if she was actually named Dara, but yeah, that's it. You don't have to kill him, but I'm going to. Look at Beavis like, I see shit down here, fucking particles. Uh. Looks so fucking serious. And you got butthead. He's like, I'm gonna look up your skirt. Chia. All right, moving on. I, I gotta say, I really don't remember this cartoon as well. I mean, I, used, I remember watching it just. I used to watch it mostly for the music videos. By the way, the weapon I have is the best weapon. Why? Is because it's unlimited and has a nice range. Look at that range. Second level though, it's gonna be a bitch, but I don't remember doing that, so hopefully I can do it well. Meow 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 meow. No! Stupid fucking skateboarding double lard piece of shit. God damn it. Oh well. So far so good. Better switch the butthead for this one. By the way, if you die... <laughs> I'm pausing because I don't want to get hit because sometimes the skateboard punks run, come out of the random. But I'm still trying to think. Whatever. But I remember if you die, you start at the very beginning or... Near the last door you went through. In this uh, sense, door. Nothing in there. Always check these fucks. And here comes the principal. That I remember. Oh look, this motherfucker, the teacher! He's always like, Beavis and Butthead, you guys are cool. Oh, and the principal grabs you, got, you can start at the very beginning. And he makes a weird ass sound. You know what, I don't mind getting touched by him. Oh, well, the teacher's there, he's not gonna help. I know I took damage, but fuck, that's a weird sound, it just... That always stuck with me. He, he takes you back to the very beginning and you get hurt, but... Everything else respawns, so if you want to grind up some, um... Health, or not health, but ammo. You can do that. Once in a while, which is rare, but the coins will pop out for it, for doing that. <laughs> Anyways, you can hit him. If he comes out, this guy will block it for me, because, you know... Yeah. But essentially, you want to be on your toes. I have two coins. I want to heal. I'm always using butthead for the principal and the skaters. I always thought that poster on the top left, I'm pausing it because I don't want to die, was, um, monkeys. I didn't know who the fuck war was. I didn't even know, like, I just, like... Anyways, if you have a chance while you're on YouTube right now watching this, check out Guar. Um, their shit's pretty crazy. You'll see their, con their live concerts, just watch it. It's pretty crazy. They're fun to watch, though. They're... kind of monster metal. Anyways, this should be the science room. And I'll show you the launch right now, cause yeah. Hopefully I can do this with like two lives. I mean one life lost. Um, you can't kill this dude, but you only need to hit him once. Yeah. I mean if you wanna play safe, just spam it. Give me life. Alright. I'll show you this right now. So you press um I think it was A to launch Beavis. And if you're Beavis, which I just switched to, your butthead comes to me. But also if you use it, you still get launched. Which is good, because if you're controlling butthead, and you launch Beavis, he ain't gonna really help you out that much. And it's kind of fun in two-player. It is actually co-op, and it's a lot easier. 
So, what's that? Dude. God damn it. If you want to be safer here, I just recommend this is all the ammo I have right now. Just, just shoot every, like, two seconds. And I have no coins. I don't know, I just feel like showing that off. <laughs> uh, but cracks. You guys saw me hit him, right? Because that was totally hit. Maybe the bullet. The animation. By the way, if, if you get caught by the principal right here, you start at the very beginning. You know that area we just did? We, that doesn't count as a checkpoint. He throws you to the very beginning. The principal is a dick! Alright, this should be another science lab. Nope, this is a mini game. Mini gamers are good, you get some health. My recommendation, take it very fucking slow. Like, seriously. You can't jump, by the way. It's just whacking. Mini boss! He backs away, you can also use the basketballs to your advantage. Take note of this because, well, you'll see in the end. Go team, go! There we go. Like I said, take this very slow. I don't, I don't like, I'm not saying you have to edge it, just... You have to be precise with this shit. Your main objective is to take off that skater, dude. And you're fine. Alright, so far so good. See? Use the basketball skater to manage here. Uh, I swear I would hit it. Oh well. I shouldn't have hesitated. Down, 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 down. You can't. No! Oh, I'm so fucking close. <laughs> yeah. Fuck it. It's a good thing you can walk under them. Because seriously, just starting to get real. Yeah, you really have to react to that, because it gets fucking real from there. Yes, they won't shit up. They won't shit up at all. That was fucking close! Alright, we're almost there. Come on. Almost there. Ah! Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I survived this long. I was supposed to be dead. No! <laughs> Shit. Come on, come on, come on. My butt. My butt's clenching. If you could only know how tight I'm clenching the butt ticks right now. My sphincter. Woo. I knew I could land it, but shit, it's real though. Like I said, I'm playing it safe. Get the fuck away from me, piece of shit. Go back to Tony, ha! Ah. I forgot the villain's name from Thug 1. Ah. Uh, you know, Tony Hawk Underground. Uh, it was Eric, I think? Yeah, he's Eric. Alright. And already, <laughs> jeez. I don't remember you being this long. Had I fucked that up? Oh, uh, we're almost done. Alright, here we go. Okay. We still have a little bit more to go. Fucking not kidding you guys, this shit's a gauntlet. But that was the next area. So, we got this part. Pay attention to the pattern, it's gonna help you out. This other motherfucker wants pizza. You can't hit him, and since we did that, I have the boxing glove on a stick. You can't hit him though. But you can't kill him. And touching him won't kill you, it's just... Just tell you right now, just play it safe. So here comes the hardest part of the game. Um, not, sorry, the hardest part of this world. It's all timing, I swear. Look at that. You, you gotta, I'm pausing it for good reason. Uh, I can't pause it there. Ah, I was about to pause it, anyways. This motherfucker with the top, he'll hit you. And then you got this hot water that's gonna kick your ass. I'm looking for the right time. A little slap, that would've been a good time. Right here. Just making sure. See? You gotta be fucking careful with this. Here's where Beavis comes in handy. I remember fucking not figuring out how to do this. 
because I fucking suck. But I switch to Beavis. By the way, you know when you switch, you know by the foreground and the background. So you can tell who I'm switching to. So see, he doesn't get hurt. And turn it off. God damn that shit gets annoying for my ear. Douche. I like controlling butthead. Here comes the gym teacher, I believe. Alright. She's gonna get real from here on. So study that. Study that and pay attention. That will hurt you. Like the e I remember what I used to do was just launch Beavis in and out. So I can like pass through it much easier. But yeah. After this is the final era. I mean like and we're done with this world, but damn, she gets brutal. I want more. Okay, where's that? That dude in the blue jeans and the black shirt who's kind of like Bobby Hill. I forgot his name too, man. I really forget the fucking names of this show. I didn't even have seen the movie too. I should really watch it. Beavis and Bearhead do America! Yeah. Just to make sure. Nope, nothing. Sometimes you have to do that to reach a life. It's kind of like Castlevania 1 where you get that. In the very beginning of the game, you can get a money bag or whatever. If you jump over the entrance. You know, Castlevania secrets. So rush that shit and get- Yep, yep, dead. And I- you're, Get used to that because you're going to be hearing that not. Guess where I'm beginning from. Tell you, man, this game is fucking brutal. All right, fast forward to me getting to the end. Shut up, Beavis. Back the fuck up, sir. Thank you. All right, you gotta really time this one, or actually. I recommend switching to Beavis for this one. I mean, you could do- he'll turn it off for you, but, like, I just recommend switching to Beavis for that one. Alright. You can't hit these guys. I mean, you can't hurt them, rather. See? Just, just timing it for it. I recommend knowing where the sprite turns off. Why did it hit me? I switched to Beavis. Okay. Anyways, do that. And do that. That's what I recommend doing. This, you have to do the same too. So, this is straight up Beavis mode. I have two coins. I am not gonna risk getting hurt, just to heal up. So, I mean, you could, but I'm not gonna risk it. I have an adequate health as it is. So, she's gonna start getting real. Seriously, just. I mean, it doesn't look tough, but it can be if, you, if you're not a. If you haven't played as much as I did when I was in my youth, I played this shit a lot. Alligator? That fucking gene teacher's gonna pop up. Also, you can't get hurt by that, from what I remember. Why are there so many fucking toilets in the fucking middle of the classway? Seriously. I should get multi hit you. That should be it. Okay, boss time! I assume it's boss time. Yep, here it is. You can tell by the fucking base riff. Yep. I wish I had a safe state. Why? Well, you'll see why. Wish I could safe state for this. Alright. So... This is area 4 of this world. Uh, we should be fine. You can hit 2 at once. Sometimes I used to be hitting... I used to hit 3. I'm telling you to be careful with this because you might need the health. Here we go. I don't know why these guys are fucking working together. But I've played this game so many times. I know these fuckers and their invincibility frames. They're not that hard. So I know I make it look easy. But if it's not, what to begin with, it's not really that hard. If you But here comes the fun part. You can make him fucking give him a picture. You have a little bit of time though. So. D pad to control one, the other one for the other. And then you press start. Actually, now that I remember, you do have a. You can actually adjust as much as you want. Forgot you press start for it. So 
So I'm controlling fucking. Oh no, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> I just I got what I wanted. The password is. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. Hey, ha, ha, ha. Seriously. And that's it for this part. <laughs> See in the next world, which is the fucking. Neighborhood. This is Opivic Santa. Take care. Keep on gaming. No fun shit. This is Opivic Santa. Take care. Keep on gaming. I'll see you in the next pot. <laughs>